All right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video. So the time has finally come for us to collect our seventh and final Purunga Dragon Ball for the first set and make our wishes. Now, of course, there are two sets in total, 14 Dragon Balls. So if you guys need help collecting any of them, then feel free to go check out that guide that I made last week. I'll put a link somewhere above my head. Okay, but anyways, the clue for today's Dragon Ball is to awaken a super or extreme power. And all that means is you gotta Z awaken a character. Of course, that's different from Extreme Z awakening or Token awakening. In this case, all you gotta do is take a character from SSR to UR. So uh, let me see here. I think I, yeah, I haven't touched my Demon King Piccolo yet. So let's awaken him or train him first and then we'll Z awaken him. And then that should give us the seven star Dragon Ball for today. Here we go. It would really suck if this didn't work, but I think it should. Okay, so he's Z Awakened, he's a UR now, and come on, okay, cancel, there we go. Okay, yeah, I was a little bit nervous for a second, not gonna lie. It's a Perugo Dragon Ball, 7 star ball acquired, okay, and there we go. All 7 Dragon Balls are done, and now we just go back to this screen right here, and click Summon. Here we go. That's pretty dope. It's a pretty dope animation. Okay, you who possess the dragon balls, state your wishes. I will grant any three. All right, so here are the wishes as follows. The first one, I want a gift card. Pretty self-explanatory. You get one of the thank you gift cards to exchange for a unit in the Baba shop. This one is I want to power up super attacks and you get three of each Grand Kai, like each type of Grand Kai. So three AGL, three SDR, three Fizz, so on and so forth. This one is I want to activate hidden potential. You get a bunch of orbs for all the different types. I forgot the actual number. I don't think it's enough to rainbow one character of each type, but it's a good amount of orbs. And uh, this one is I want a full belly. Basically you get some meats. Uh, medium and small I believe I think it's like 15 small and 5 medium or something to that effect and of course the meats are for replenishing stamina for free without uh, using stones right or not for free but you know without using stones and this one is I want to attempt lots of events this one gives you a bunch of event keys for the uh, portal of memories I believe it's 30 of each type for the story events uh, challenge slash token events and uh, extreme sea battles uh, next up we have I want treasures and support items. It's 777 incredible gems as well as a bunch of you know different support items. And the last wish is I want to strengthen allies. You get a bunch of Hercule statues for Zenny and also training items and I think awakening medals too. So those are the seven wishes. If you guys want a full breakdown of what each wish gives you like the exact number of orbs and training locations and so on and so forth. And uh, you can also find that in the video I talked about earlier, okay? But as far as my wishes go, uh, I'm gonna have to go for Kai's uh, orbs and probably keys. No, probably meats. I don't know. I'm a little bit conflicted, honestly, because like neither of these can be farmed. And uh, Incredible Gems, of course, can be farmed, so I'm not gonna go for that. And the same thing with training items and support items, even though it takes a while, you can farm them as much as you want. So um, I do think that the orbs, kais, meats, as well as keys are the most valuable. There's also the gift card, which for some people could be really good value too, right? Especially if you're missing a bunch of the units. But for me personally, um, I'm pretty sure every single one of those units is at 100%, so it doesn't make sense. So I'm gonna skip that for sure. But uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna go for, I'm gonna go for Super Attack or Grand Kai's, uh, Hidden Potential or Orbs, and let's get some meat. Okay, so that was, that sounded really weird. Um, <laughs> those are my wishes for the first set. Keep in mind, you can make two sets of wishes. Okay, so once you collect seven more Dragon Balls over the next seven days, you can get, you know, the keys or you can get the training items or whatever you want as your um, you know, additional wishes. All right, so there we go. We got our items, and now the Dragon Ball Scatter. Barunga's gone, and the Scatter says there is no signal from the Dragon Radar. Tomorrow, there will be a new clue. Once again, if you guys just want to know 
how to get all of these Dragon Balls without trying to figure out what the clue means, then just go watch that video. It should help a lot. But uh, our items should be in our gift box now. Let me try to get in there. And here we go. Okay, so it's actually 7 medium meats, 15 small, uh, 60 large orb of each type, 640 medium of each type, as well as 1300 small of each type. So you're about like a third of the way to a rainbow unit with each one, but it's all five types. So like I said, a good amount of orbs for sure. And we're also getting three Grand Kai's of each type, which is also nice, especially because they don't take up box space anymore. So I don't have to worry about like clearing out space for these guys. So let's collect everything. There we go. Uh, pretty nice guys, pretty nice rewards. I wish there was a Dragon Ball option, or not Dragon Ball, Dragon Stone option, right? Like at least make it like 10 stones or something like that. And that would definitely be the first choice for most people. But regardless, even though there's no Dragon Stones, I still think that these wishes are pretty good in terms of the rewards they give us. So uh, there you go. That is the first set. We'll be back with set number two in seven days once they're all collectible. And uh, let me know in the comments down below what wishes you guys made. Were they the same ones that I went with or did you do something different? And uh, also let me know why you chose those wishes, okay? But that's it guys, that is today's video. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now, and while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.